Hello, honeys, and welcome back to another interesting episode of Karen's in the Wild. Take a look. In this first clip, our AT&T customer questions the manager at the store why he had to call the cops on him. You will not believe the manager's response. Take a look. What reason Frankly, because did you have to call the cops on me? When you came in yeah. and the door slammed, that was that was not your fault. That was, that was just the door. The door so the door slammed. Let me finish. Okay. The door was sticky. That's fine. Okay. But when you try and see things from my point of view, you come in and everything else aside, you come in, you take off your, your shoes, you lay down. I can't lay down? I'm a customer of AT&T. There's a reason why they have a freaking sofa down there, okay? So pretty much so the customers can feel re relaxed. This is the reason why the store is here. You understand that? I'm a customer here, okay? I if I want to take off my slippers and relax, you don't have any right to call the cops on me. Yeah, okay, I understand. I and that's definitely something I could do. I'm not doing anything wrong. Okay. So what? So that's pretty much why you call the cops on me because I was I took off my slippers. And I was just relaxing. That's why you come. I was speaking to customer service. And AT and T swearing as well. What? You called the cops on him because he took off his shoes to relax, and he was swearing. Can someone please let me know if swearing is illegal? Why did he have to call the cops? Why? Because did he... I was scared, okay? I was Because I'm scared. black? No, not because you're black. Because I'm black? That's no, the only no. reason. What else? What? There's no other reason for you to call the cops on me. Because I'm black? No. Well, what else? There's no other reason for you to call the cops on me. You were acting erratically. Come on now, dog. Come on, man. How was that acting erratically? You couldn't tell because I slammed the door or I, I, I took off my slippers? That's the reason I was acting erratic? Considering how what people are what people are usually like around here, yeah. The customer at the AT&T store is definitely in the wrong. He shouldn't have taken off his shoes to relax. Come on, those couches are meant for sitting and not for napping. The manager, on the other hand, I think he went too far for calling the cops on him because he was relaxing on the couch and swearing. Oh my goodness, y'all won't believe this. So this Karen confronts a couple over a parking spot. Apparently, Karen believes that the couple stole the parking spot from her. Take a listen. This is not your spot. Uh, I'm I was here, ma'am. You, you are I don't the biggest, your... ma'am. You're whatever this is is the biggest loser. I am. Loser. You are right. You are a loser, my yes, friend. Yes, ma'am. Loser. Yes, ma'am. Only a loser does that. This I... is. He has no honor, no ethics. None at all. You should both be ashamed of yourself. We... You for hanging out with a loser, and you for being a deadbeat loser. Damn! Yes. I am taking a picture of your driver's license. Okay. Of your license. Really, Karen? So what are you going to accomplish by taking a picture of his license plate? Be for real. The guy already got the parking spot, Karen. Perfect. Be ready. Yeah, perfect, because you're a loser. I can tell how comfortable you are with stealing a spot. Yes, ma'am. I, I hope you have a great oh, day. It smells like garbage. You're a I, I hope you have a great day. I will. I will. Good. Oh, I mean, I have no shame, so I feel fine about it, too. I, I have plenty of money. I'm here to tell you right now, we don't care. Let me tell, right, let me tell you, <laughs> we don't care. I can go ballot. Oh, then I would have done that already. I'm poor. I need this spot. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I think the guy handled that like a champ. His responses were so satisfying. Please take your time to watch this clip of an entitled Karen who demands that Target compensates her 
for a thousand dollars worth of groceries. Trust me, you will not regret watching this clip. Take a look. Safe for fire. So what happened? She okay. She made it up to her at uh, twenty forty six. Okay. Came up. I tried to verbally deescalate. Uh -huh. She told me that she wanted to wreck it out, and I told her we couldn't do that. Okay. And then she said, "Excuse me," and I was like, "Ma'am, like I need you to back up or leave, like, but we can't do that for you." So she started charging at me. I came all the way back into my office, into an enclosed space, uh -huh. and I hit her in the face. Okay. Are you I have it all on video. Ma'am, are you okay? Physically, I'm okay. Emotionally, I'm yeah. here. Car 4 David 31. Okay. In front of the big line. Uh, let me test your face. That's the eight person. No, do you left still side. need glasses? No, with my glasses, I didn't even have to off my face, yes. I tried to close you out of my office and you just kept on pushing your way in. That's right. No, sir. I didn't push my way in. Yes, I can. No, I came around the corner quickly. Uh, hey, would you I did not push quit talking? Door. Hey, no. Excuse Let's you? Stop talking when I'm telling you. You stop talking, okay? Do you know who I am? I, I will figure that out when I get your ID. You have cameras here, right? That's all. That's all that matters. You clearly don't know who I am. Man. Is your ID in here? Is your ID in here? No. I need the May I see it? Sure. Why do you need my ID? And you're not taking his. To identify him. We know who he is. How? What's his name? We've been here many, many times. May you identify him. Have your ID? If I have to get my ID in this situation, I'll why get his ID mean? too. Don't worry exactly. about it. This is. This has All right, to be right. You're just digging a hole here. No. Let me have We're going to do this the right way. Man. We've been doing ID. it the wrong Man. way for a long. No, he. Thank yes, you. Is. Thank you. ID. Thank you. No, we're going to do this properly. If we're going to have this conversation, we will do it properly. A few moments later. Yeah. So, if you want to go first, like, what, what happened? Okay. Um, so, I was walking by. Mm -hmm. Wendy calls me and says that this woman asked to speak to a manager. Okay. Which, like, happens a lot. Yeah. So, I was like, mm -hmm. Come here. Okay. Okay. That's and she said, I'm not going to have enough money to pay for this. I need to talk to a manager. She happened to be walking by. Okay, and you were a manager? Okay. And so they started here. You can finish that part. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I I came around and I was like, hey, what can I do for you? Okay. Usually it's like like a the price as well or whatever. Uh -huh. She starts going on this, this spiel about uh, like about how like I've had a privileged life, and she's been disadvantaged, and then said that she was asking Target to make reparations for her. What? Is she for real? Going all the way to Target to ask that Target makes reparations for her? Wow. And I said, that's not something we can do tonight. If, like, if you need a donation, like, you can call tomorrow. I can put you in touch like, with the HR person, but like, that isn't something I can do for you, like, right now tonight. Okay. And then she like she was like, You need okay. to put me in touch with someone tonight. And I was like, I can't. There isn't Okay. Like strange. Yeah. Strange. So like she just basically just kept saying that. And then she got really close to me. Mm -hmm. So I put my hands up and backed up and she like followed me. She was like like breathing into my eyes. Was she screaming at you or Yeah. yeah. So she got really close to me. I put my hands up. I touched her shoulders mm -hmm. because she was like coming into my space. Okay. Um, and then she, like, because I touched her, she like went to the unit after that and just no started screaming questions. really loudly and like that me against the soda machine. Okay. And then that's Maybe. when like our security person, yeah, he called. She called our security person mm -hmm. and he came over and like. A few moments later. So what caused the issue out here today? Because I came in. in uh, actually, is kind of target is situation. somewhat of a home for me. And we were going to have a big discussion here. And I asked them to be nice. 
Who are you going to have this big discussion with? With Target, whoever in Target I needed to speak with. What were you asking her to do? Reach out to her manager so we can have a larger discussion about how money works and how provision works and how it's been working in our community from a very long way. Can you elaborate a little bit, go into further detail? Sure. I'm asking for the support of my community to come behind me in a big way to have a money conversation. And there are people segregated and locked out of things. We have decided we were not going to have a bigger conversation. I decided to take a stand. This is my Rosa Parks moment, dude. Don't play with me. What an embarrassment. This Karen is such a gaslighter. Using woke rhetoric as a weapon to take advantage? What a shame. I'm just listening. That's all I'm doing. We're having a conversation about how to reconcile the fact that some people benefited off of a system that was bringing in other people. I asked nicely to have that conversation. Okay, what were you asking for? To talk to, for her to connect me with who I could talk to. What was your purpose of that con that further conversation? What were you going to ask that person for to do? To break the lies around money. What's that mean? We all know money has not been treating everybody equally. Okay. And money is not the only way for things to happen. It's were, you, not were you asking for them to make a donation, essentially? Or to let you have them for free? No, what was it? I was coming up to the limit of where... I had money. I was trying to ask if Target would comp me the rest and we would have a conversation, a bigger bubble up a bigger conversation about why Target, because I know the heart of this place. Okay. It's the right place for me to have this conversation. Yeah, Target's a good company. Exactly. Yeah. And I was trying to have a hard conversation in a safe place. Yeah. So did you... No, 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 no. People hit me for that. I did it the right way. I went through the right steps. They kept... The reason the problem why money doesn't work right is because it blocks people at checkpoints. And I'm tired of people locking good people out. You don't get paid what you deserve. Well, other than nearly as much yeah. because yeah. choosing yeah. to do the right yeah. thing in this yeah. world costs us monetarily. Yeah. That's not fair. Yeah. The system is rigged against yeah. people yeah. doing the right thing. Okay. Because so, this world is selfish. I will disagree there are good with that. Especially when I was trying to have a bigger discussion of that. How selfish people are holding other people down for that. Y'all are in this too. So. Can I, I live across. I, no, this is the aisle I crossed because my dad is a police was a police officer in the military. Mm -hmm. He hit my mom. She called you guys. We lived in a white neighborhood. I knew you were good because I knew my dad. He was supposed to come in and mediate, but he wasn't comfortable with the way we looked. So he stood at the door and said, "Ma'am, you should just stay." And she listened, and it broke our entire family. He did not do his job because he was scared. No, no, I will give you another example. Can I talk for a second? Sure. All right. So to simplify what happened outside, you had a certain amount of money that was with you, correct? And they asked, and you asked somebody um, to cover the rest, correct? So that was your goal. That was your goal, correct? To cover the rest? Yes, and you, and, and so were you anticipating, can I please finish? Yeah. Were you anticipating that that matter would be resolved right here, right now? No. Okay. I knew she, I, want, I asked her to put me in touch with her. Because that would be unreasonable to anticipate that somebody at this level could monetarily exactly. make a decision for a business. But they blocked me from the bigger... Well, you could have called us. We could have absolutely helped you get a phone number. The internet's got phone numbers. We could have found it. You could have found That's it. That's fine, but I wasn't the wrong one in the situation. Wow, this is crazy. But am I the only one that thinks that this woman here needs professional help for real? Um, Ashley was able to tell me as far as the door. Because she said the door shut. She couldn't see you two inside. Yeah, so I tried to... 
literally close her out, but at that point she was like pretty much running, so she barreled her way in and mm -hmm. then kept coming into my office. Okay. And you just hit her and that's it? Hit her like right in the face like that girl. Oh, now we know why she got hit in the face. That manager was just trying to defend himself, I think. Um, Claire, Ashley, uh, minimum, minimum tonight is banning her from, from premises, I'm guessing. Pressing charges, something like that. Yeah, attempted assault at least. I mean, yeah. A few moments later. You can uh, stand up, let's go outside. Sure. Grab your, your bag. We'll explain everything outside. Why are we you want to go ahead and tell her she's not Yeah, ma'am, as of today, you're trespassed from Target. I'm sorry? As of today, you're trespassed from Target. On the basis of you hitting me? Ma'am, let's go. Outside. No, no, that is not going to Either you walk out on your own or in handcuffs. Oh, I will be arrested for this cause. Come on. No, I'm not going to move. Like, don't make this uh, nope. more you're gonna, No, me. it's going to be on camera. Where are you holding your lines at? Come on. So it's very it's very straightforward. Any business can refuse a customer. Mm -hmm. so I go to Wendy's and I like my haircut. They don't have to serve does me. Does he have to? That's all he, this is. So he, he, has, gets, he gets the right to kick, kick me out after he hits me? He didn't bowl so that? He can't bowl that up in management? He is speaking asked, on behalf of the company at this really, point. Really? Exactly. So he can speak on behalf of the company at that level, but he couldn't do it there? I wasn't out there. I'm sure tensions were a little different than they are at this moment in time. So. <gasps> no, you're going to reconcile that. You're not going to give me any more lies. You will tell the truth about the situation. No, 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 no. You are trying no. to arrest me for him hitting me. Correct. You are under arrest. Yes. You're under arrest for menacing and disorderly conduct. Okay? Now, here's what we would like to do. We would Let's rather you walk outside thing. and not make a big deal. If you're going to make oh, a big no, deal, we're going to have to handcuff you and do yes, all that other stuff. Yes, you will. Yes, you will. Let's go. Right. Right. I'm not going to. Don't move. get resisting to. Okay? Let's do it. Let's not. If we're going to go into it, let's do it. If you're, you're going to hold every line. You know what You know what happened here. I know. I just watched the video. I asked to open a conversation, and he's still blocking me out, and you guys are protecting it. Ma'am, you chased the one employee all the way to the front. Okay? You made contact with her body by pushing your body and hers. I just watched it clear as day on the video. Okay. He then came out and you followed him all the way back here. Okay. Making him fear for his safety. You backed him into an office and you got hit in the face, unfortunately. When people who are backed into a corner, they can choose, no, no, they can choose to do the right thing or they can choose to lash out. Okay, you were in the wrong here, just so we're clear. I held the line. You didn't hold and the I, line. No, no, I, I moved my line continuously. I asked, and when they did not respect, they were gatekeeping me. Like the whole world has kept people. Yeah, you were you, free to leave at any time. Absolutely. But you didn't. Absolutely. So because it wasn't you right. amplified the situation. No, no you wanted something When the laws freedom. are not right, you, wanted something you make a stand so they can change. I tell you. The patience of these officers is truly amazing. If the laws are meant to hold people down, you will fight for me, my community. Okay. Let's go outside. Okay. You will come for me. Okay. Let's go outside. Trying to give you the chance right now, just like before. You're, you're elevating the situation when it doesn't need to be. It's already done. It's not done. It's done. Absolutely Tonight not. Tonight it's done. No, it's not. You're not. Your pe people that look like you are done trying to gatekeep people that look like me. No, ma'am. What happened? What happened? You got mad at them because they wouldn't give you your you card little, for free. I literally, no. Yes. You saw my heart. You understand what I was trying to do. I explained it to you. Yeah, you were trying to have them comp some of the extra stuff. Yes. Stuff well, that you couldn't afford. A large conversation. And then that large conversation spoiled into this, unfortunately. And this Correct. is where we are. That this doesn't, is... just because your intentions were good, does not make this any less illegal, unfortunately. Right. So we but have. But what happens when the so laws are not okay for people? 
I, I, just I have to enforce the laws that are in place. Okay, that is our job. That is our goal. But he's not getting arrested for assault. He's it's not assault. He's defending himself. We're all, we're all watching this, right? Absolutely. We're all watching this together. You see where the police are holding the lines of my people. Ma'am, you were the laws. In the wrong. No, I wasn't. Yes, you were. No, this but is here's the problem. Thing. Even if we're wrong, that's what courts for. So we don't need to argue about it. We just have to go with what probable cause and what the law states, okay? You can't touch other people, okay? You can't make other you people. Did you did. I watched the video, okay? You can't do that. You can't make people feel for their safety. That's why it's menacing, okay? You can't chase employees back in offices. I asked, That's disorderly conduct. He asked me. He was gatekeeping me. Ma'am, you were free to leave. No, he, he, he knew about the police. He said... I will call the police. And instead of doing that, he ran back here. And you chased him. To have that conversation. No, you are completely wrong. No, there yes. was not at any time that my hands came up to do anything to anybody. Uh -huh. When I did, I stood my ground. Okay, and you and were when wrong. people, no, I wasn't. Standing your ground is not wrong if you're standing it in the truth. Okay. If there are places where the system is broken and rigged against people, Anybody. Okay. Here's the what rules do. need to change. Okay. They're not changing tonight. Okay. We have to go by the Ohio Revised Code. You're holding me down. This is what we're going to do right now in this we, moment? You are going right to do your arrest. arrest okay. Yes. For him hitting me. I'm clearing this up. Yes, ma'am. You know what I was trying to do? I understand what you're trying to do. It doesn't make it any less illegal what happened today, okay? I understand. So, but you're not talking, you're not having that bigger conversation with them and helping level them up in understanding. You know, I right? explained what you were, what you did. Just because there's a deeper thought and a deeper level but that he, you have no, doesn't make it less deep, illegal. The deeper part was he wasn't the right person to have that conversation with. He did not do his part. Instead, he hit me. Defending himself, He hit yes. a woman. He hit a woman out of his own fear. I'm not disagreeing. He hit a woman today. Yeah, absolutely he did. And it was in his own defense. So what we are going to do is either A, we can walk out peacefully, or B, we can do it in cuffs. Why was he not, no, why was he not being arrested? And because he said he could have called the cops. He realized he had a choice in that and moment. And chased him into his office. So here's the okay, and we're done. I need you to turn around and put your hands behind your back. You're under arrest. Oh. Thank you. I hate my rights. As a human being, to protect the law. Do you have anything on your person that's going to poke us, prod us, or cut us? No? Okay. You see it? Good, your job is with good people. I don't disagree that you're no, a good no, person. No, no, no. Here, keep on walking. Your We're job, almost here. You're, you're having a conversation. Absolutely. Oh, you've, you've had we'll have a conversation the from the hall. back seat. Come on. You're going to sit in the back seat with me? I'll stand outside the back seat with you. Okay. And I asked nicely, and I got refused, and I stood a line that scared them, and they lashed out. So do you think you could have approached it in a different manner than how we approached it today and probably got the same goal, the same end? Well, how would you, how do you expect... Or I'm asking for something at the register to be done. Mm -hmm. The cash register couldn't, the cashier couldn't do it for me. I asked, they asked her to bubble it up to a manager. That's what you do. You take it up the chain of command. Absolutely man. you do. Yeah. But they, they, this is the problem. My people have been trying to take it up the chain of command and they are getting smacked back down because the laws are not in their favor. For you to take a hard stand, I, I just got hit. They were gatekeeping me. They didn't. They told me they were not so going to help me. So can I just ask a? Just... I asked. No, no, no. I asked a very nice and polite question to that young lady. I said, "She said I am the only one here. I can't help you. I can't do that for you." Mm -hmm. Okay. I. Um, it was approaching. It was a little over a thousand dollars. A thousand dollars and a little bit of change. Mm -hmm. Where she was ringing up, I could see that. It wasn't going, I wasn't going to be able to get everything without assistance. Yeah. 
Did you have like a coupon you could have used? Could you have no, asked sir. for a discount? Nothing no, like sir. that. So you no, were sir. you were out of money and you asked for a discount basically? Asked them to comp for like a couple hundred bucks? I asked them to have the larger conversation with me. Why is it that people when it gets to a point where a young man reached out and hit an older black woman? Regardless of age, race, anything. It's you don't not, hit somebody. You don't hit people, but I can also understand why he did. He was defending himself. You How? you chased him into a closed office where he had no point of exit. Right. That was yeah. the point. I was forcing him to have a conversation. And you were forcing him to become scared and in fear. That's the downside. Let's say I fall. My people I, I have fall. been scared Put and in fear. To, my people have been scared and in fear to come into a lot of your places. Because yeah. you've, they've been if, kept if out. If I do the same thing as you just did, he'd probably hit me in the face too, though. But I have been kept out, and I was asking to come in, and he was continuing to keep me out. And you can't have it both ways. Either he had the authority, or he didn't. Either he reached up to his higher authority, because you know how it works. You Maybe bunk, he would have called you him don't, tomorrow. You never know. I was asking for something to happen in that moment. He couldn't do that in that moment. That's not true. It seems like it may be. I don't I know. I don't her. have his opportunities. I, I don't know his her. job. I don't know how it works here. So I'm a police officer, not a target manager. Wow. The entitlement of this woman is shocking for real. But my advice to her is the next time when she's going to shop, she needs to make use of the calculator on her phone as she shops. Also, I think she just wants something for nothing. But that's my thought. Let me know what is yours in the comment section. Finally, on another episode of Karen's in the wild. So this Karen calls the cops on someone that she thought was recording her while in public. Take a look. You got my permission to record me? You got my permission to record me? Six feet. Do you got my Six permission feet. to record me? Who are you? Do you got my permission to record? Who me? are you? Do you got my permission to record? Who are you? Me? Do you got my permission? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Have a good day. Yeah, I know. You Have a good day, Chucky. Have a good day, Chucky. A few moments later. No, no, no. She's complaining that you're following her. What's going on? She followed me. Okay. I went to my car. She got behind me. She followed me around. Okay. I, I'm just recording. Okay, because she feels like she, she's intimidated. No, that's, not my, that's, not, that's, not, that's not my no, issue. I understand, but you have to understand. You're law she's enforcement a or feedings? You're law enforcement or feedings enforcement? Excuse me? Do you enforce feedings or law? No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Just she, let her know that she public... doesn't feel comfortable. So what does that have with, to do with me? Well, because you're following her. I'm not following her. I was recording it. She followed me all around the block. Oh, okay. Fine. Why don't you listen to me? It's, I have the camera. Up next, you will be watching how Karen was schooled by the officer about how it's not illegal for someone to record in public. Take a look. But you have that right to record. And just like you have the right to record. Everybody has the right to record. But you don't have the right to follow him around because he's recording. Don't do that because you can put yourself in danger, okay? You don't do that. You don't confront nobody. You don't walk up to somebody and ask them why he has his camera in your face. You know what? You don't do that. That's right. Tell her officer that everyone has a right to record in public.